I'm Schleck Course Lover 200, and welcome back to part two of my January Barn Tour of 2016 of Silver Star Stables. Okay, so we left off right here at the Stallion's Pasture, and in front of the Stallion's Pasture is Emily's Tack Box. So, inside of her Tack Box is just this Western Saddle and Girth I made her. And beside her um, tack box is this little snowman that I made. Alright, so right here in this little paddock is Pearl and Perlina. They are both Appaloosas, and Perlina here is a yearling. And then they have their hay and watering trough. And down from that over here is Steve riding Buck. Steve is my brother's person, and Buck is my horse. And that is Spike right there. So right here is another barn I have. It's a retired Schleck barn. I got it from a yard sale. And inside is Sagebrush. She's an Appaloosa mare. I got her from a yard sale. She's not a Schleck, but I painted her. And beside her is Sparks. He is a Tennessee Walker stallion. He's the older one. And they both have their pellets. And over from them is this other stall. It's a bit bigger. And in it, we have Trickster, the 2015 Tennessee Walker Stallion. And he has his hay and water. And here is just a random halter that is laying on the floor. And right there is a watering trough that is on the side of the barn. Over here is where we store our wagons. And this is our little pony cart which we just keep right there. And my hay wagon is being driven by John right now, so it is out. And yeah, you'll see them later. Over from that is this other paddock. And in it is my brother's horses. So this is his Pinto Stallion Dynamite, his Pinto Yearling Lavender, his other Pinto Mare Dinah, and his Pinto Mare Violet. And they have their hay and this other little hay feeder right there. And down from that is this tack box, which we just keep extra stuff in it, like um, things like bridles and things for the pony carts, and there's some saddlebags right here, and some dog collars, and a camping set. So that's what's in that tack box. Basically just extra stuff. So right here is John, and he is driving this hay wagon I made. If you want to know how to make this hay wagon, just go check out my new hay wagon video, and I show you how I make this wagon. And in the back of it are just some hay bales, and there's this little dog. It, it's um, Steve's little dog. His name's um, Samson, and he's just riding in the back of the hay wagon. And pulling the wagon is King and Bella, or Bella Fella. They're both tinkers, and John's just driving it. And across from them is this little stall that I made especially for Rosa's family, because her family is such big, so big because she has two foals. So this is Rosa, and her show name is Aspen Gold, and she's a halflinger. And these are our two halflinger foals, Sunshine and Lily. And then they have their feed and hay back there. Out front is just this little grooming kit. The front of the stall also has a gate. So if you open up the gate, there's also a chain across the front of the stall. Alright, so down from Rosa's family is this little area where we have nothing really in it. And down from that is another room built out of popsicle sticks, which is our feed room. If you want to know how to build this feed room, go check out my new feed room video. And in that video, I show you everything you need to know on how to build this feed room. Okay, so, in this feed room, I have a wheelbarrow, and right here, there's two shelves, and on the top shelf is this bottle of fly spray, and down from it is this little bucket of treats, right there, and over there is some more treats, and right here is this big wooden tote, kind of like, thing. And if you open it, inside is where we store all of our carrots. 
And above our carrot bin is just this little sign that says Silver Star Stables. And over from the carrot bin is this bag of dog food. And right here on this shelf is where we have our apples. So this is red apples and green apples. And right here is just a pitchfork and broom leaning up against the wall. All right, so down from the feed room, we have two tack boxes. And the first tack box is pretty much just more extra stuff. So there's an extra western saddle and saddle pad, a few extra halters that I made. And the next tack box is Lizzie's tack box, which just has her shellac saddle, her shellac bridle, and the shellac um, reins off of her bridle. And down from those two tack boxes is our um, blanket storage, halter storage, and lead rope storage. So this little bin has all the lead ropes. This bigger one has all the halters. And this rabbit coop is not a rabbit coop. It's where we store our blankets. So all the blankets are inside. And up top here is just some more blankets that I didn't put away. And sitting on them is little Sylvester, our cat. And beside the blanket coop is just a little bit of muck. And over from that is the entrance to my main barn. Okay, so if you go in the barn, on the first stall on the left is my Shire Stallion, Clyde, our flying knight. And out front of Clyde's stall is just Adam grooming Coco, my trackner filly. And out front of his stall, he also has a ribbon and this little bag that has nothing in it. Down from Clyde is Ginger, or Ginger May. She's a Tennessee Walker yearling. And out front of her stall is just all kinds of trophies and ribbons. And underneath the shelf is this little jar, treat jar that has nothing in it. And all the stalls have this little chain out front on a jump ring that I can unlatch. The next stall down from Ginger is empty, and the stall down from that one has Princess in it. Princess is an Arabian mare, and out front of her stall is a saddle rack I made out of popsicle sticks. Down from Princess's stall is this room where we normally store our hay. On the wall here we just have some posters. Um, this is just a chart that shows Chuckster's ancestors. His father, his mother, and his grandmother, and his grandfather. Over in front of that is a bulletin board, which just has a bell racing sign up, a Silver Star Stable sign, and a jumping sign up, and there's just a big bow on it. Then right here in the corner is this little bed that just has a bunch of cat toys in it, and right there is a Miss Taffy, one of our farm cats. And over from the cat bed is this small stall that Mystery is in. Mystery is the 2014 Arabian Marin, and her show name is Mystery Morning. And all the stalls also have their watering buckets. Down from Mystery is an empty stall, and down from the empty stall is Bucca's stall. Bucca is a retired Persian mare, and she is just wearing this halter and blanket that I made. On the front of Bucca's stall, there's just a ribbon, a telephone, on the shelf and underneath the shelf a bag of treats. The next stall down has Blossom in it. Blossom is an Albatiki mare. And on the front of her stall is a radio grooming kit and a ribbon. And there is also a little halter right here on the floor. And last but not least, Peach. Peach is a Palomino quarter horse and she is also a custom of mine. In her stall there is a little bit of muck. And out front of her stall is a feeding schedule, a ribbon, and this little medical kit. Outside the barn again is this wash stall. In it is a bag of pellets, a halter, and two grooming kits. Around from the wash stall is um, our Silver Star Stables sign. Here's our logo, and down here it just says Silver Star Stables, and there is some snow out front of the sign. All right, everybody, thank you so much for watching part one and part two of my January of 2016 Silver Star Stables Barn Tour. Bye!